been a long time coming but what better day than today so today i want to talk about silence silence okay first i'll read from job chapter 7 verse 6 to about 11 yes um the bible reads my days are swifter than a weaver's shuttle and are spent without hope Oh, remember that my life is wind. My eye will no longer see good. The eye of him who has seen me will see me no more. Your eyes are on me, but I will be no more. As a cloud is consumed and vanishes away, so he who goes down to the grave will come up no more. He will return no more to his house, nor will his place know him anymore. Therefore, I will not restrain my mouth. I will speak in the anguish of my spirit. I will complain in the bitterness of my soul. Okay, so this um, excerpt is talking about Job. Job, okay, we were taught in Sunday school that Job didn't complain, but Job did complain. Just like a disclaimer out there. And he's complaining, he's saying before he goes to the grave where he, where he ha he'll have no chance of expressing what he feels. Let him say everything that he feels. At this point in his anguish you know like the entire story about job yes so what i'm bringing out today is that silence seems like the better escape because you don't hurt anybody you just like store up all the, the junk inside you and you don't hurt anyone because you're not saying anything so people come and they spit on you and they say stuff to you and they insult you or they just mistreat you and like sideline you or they're biased towards others and not towards okay, or not like a balanced kind of situation where you can all express yourself or feel or feel non-discriminated you, you we, we take okay, now i tend to keep quiet because i feel like I won't hurt anyone but that's not right and I discovered it because the silence inside begins to grow and becomes something else on the inside becomes bitterness and anger I'm glad that I've learned that anger God is able to melt anger into compassion so when I gave him when I gave it all up to him I told him I won't keep silent but I won't talk to people themselves I'll talk to you instead he and I let out everything that I'm feeling to God I write it down or I just like scream into my pillow and I tell him what I'm feeling and he turns that anger towards those people into compassion and now I don't feel like these people really hate me I feel like oh maybe they don't like understand 